Prince William is quitting his day job. He spent more than seven and a half years in the military, but is now retiring from service to focus on well being royal. And he isn't wasting any time getting down to business. He and the Duchess of Cambridge stepped out for a charity gala tonight. The couple left two month old Prince George at home for the Tusk Conservation Awards. William is a patron to the African charity that focuses on wildlife conservation. Stuart Kerr has more on the Prince's next chapter. After flying 156 missions and saving more than 140 lives as a search and rescue pilot, Prince William is hanging up his wings. The Duke of Cambridge is leaving active military service, completing his last shift on Tuesday. He'll now focus on his charities. The one closest to his heart is wildlife conservation. In an excerpt from a new documentary, William talks about his passion to prevent the poaching of elephants and rhinos. You want to stand up for, for what is very vulnerable and what needs protecting. I think the last few weeks for me have been just a very different emotional experience. Um, something I never thought I would feel myself. William is certainly more paternal and busy with the arrival of his son Prince George in July. But as future king, there is also pressure on him to take over more royal duties. Queen's now 87, Duke of Edinburgh's 92, hasn't been in the best of health. So the royals need William and, uh, and Kate and Harry, of course. I think it's time for uh, him to step up and uh, do some of those duties. But this will be a period of transition. And apart from a visit to Australia in the next year, don't expect William to dramatically raise his profile. One thing we mustn't expect is Prince William to end his career in the URAF and military duties and then all of a sudden be ploughing into three, four hundred engagements a year as the Duke of Cambridge. I don't think that's going to happen. In the next few weeks, William and Kate will be swapping their cosy Walsh cottage near an RAF base for the regal confines of Kensington Palace. This was William's childhood home and it's where the couple intends to raise baby George. And of course, once William and Kate settle into their new home, they may be tempted to expand their new family. They already have the heir. It won't be long before they start thinking about the spare. I think the spare will arrive within a couple of years. I don't think they'll, they'll hang around. They'll want to have, uh, have a second child. Be interested to see if they have a third. So with one mission accomplished, William will have plenty of other duties to keep him busy. Stuart Greer, Global News, London.